What's good my peep, welcome back to the channel if you're new, press that subscribe button. Arsenal 3, Tottenham, shit Spurs 1. What a performance, what a win and we've got Super Mika Arteta, who thought I would ever say that, you understand? But yeah man, started a game, the way we've started every single game this season, high pressing, um, high intensity, you understand, togetherness team fighting for every ball um but yeah we go one nil up to a brilliant goal from thomas party and arsenal fans will know this brother has tried to shoot like that for the last two years and normally it's a rugby kick outside the stadium like the technique is right but normally he doesn't have the right connection you understand today perfect connection beautiful goal but you know what it's spurs who play horrible football by the way that have been winning like that this season to be fair um I knew the only way they're scoring today is a mistake from us or a counter-attack where we're exposed. And guess what happened? We got a bit exposed. Um, clumsy defending, clumsy tackle, penalty. And um, yeah, Gabriel needs to get that out of his game though. Gabriel has a habit of being rash. He needs to learn from William Saliba to just stay composed. But he's still young. I feel like he's got more, um, more to learn. So he will develop because he's got the aggression, the intensity to match people in the Premier League. But he just needs more composure. Harry penalty, Kane scores again a penalty um, for Tottenham. You understand? Um, I think he's the highest scoring um, player in the North London derby. Um, so yeah, congrats to him for that because that's probably the closest to winning something that he will get but um yeah um so yeah Tottenham equalized but one thing about Arsenal this season what do we have we have this thing called reaction we'll react you understand so second off came out all guns blazing again you understand same tempo same intensity playing beautiful football and um yeah a howler from Hugo Lloris that brother there, I see a lot of like um, sports channels basically doing their best, the combined 11 for North, L North London Derby, Derby innit? and a lot of people are saying Lloris start and keep it. I'm like, bro, have you not been watching my man? Yes, World Cup champion. You can't hold that for the rest of your life. You understand? He's been making these howlers for the last three, four years. You understand? He's got that in his game. And Howler and Gabriel Jesus. I'm telling you, this guy, like... All-round play has been the most impressive striker in the Premier League this season. I said all-round play. If you want to talk about goals, then Haaland, of course, because he's scoring psh, crazy amount of goals. But Jesus, what he's done for Arsenal, like, forget the goals, the pressing, the the, the dribbling, the vision, the link-up play. Everything about him has just been immaculate. And he's there as well to score them easy chances. Scores, you understand, 2-1 up. Emerson Royal, oh my god, Barcelona scammed Tottenham into buying this guy. This guy never even made, I don't even think he played a game for Barcelona and they sold him to Tottenham. Tottenham got excited thinking, mm, if Barcelona signed this guy, there must be something about him. And that guy is a fraud, got a red card today, made no difference anyways because we're the better team either way. Um, and later on, Shaka, the new court hero for the fans. Shaka, Mr. Consistent now. The guy who, when when he plays of party, just looks fantastic great goal we all know he's got a great strike what we've always added to his game this year he's got the freedom to go forwards positions changed because he was never a cdm and look what he's doing he's giving us goals or, or assist you understand great great goal by shaka 3-1 we destroy spurs and yeah we answer the questions people have said oh we ain't played top six teams because when we played united we lost even though we gave an impressive performance but today it's tottenham you understand our rivals we slapped them we slapped them 3-1 comfortable. Um, big up Saliba. I say I said he's the best young centre back. Best young. Keyword young centre back. Um, but yeah, man, I hope he just continues that composed game. He had man in pockets. You understand? He had man. What was Harry Kane doing apart from the penalty? Nothing. Where was Son? Richarlison's a pest, isn't it? He's that man that just is everywhere. But yeah, man, we controlled it, man. But big up party and big up Rascal Shaka. Big up our front three today as well. Zechenko as well, big him up. But yeah, man, um, Spurs. Let's talk about Spurs. Conte's horrible football. When he was winning, it was good because the fans couldn't say nothing. But I've been saying it. Every time I react to Tottenham, the football is pure dead. It's dead. They've got an attacking team, but they don't really attack. Poor football, man. But yeah, man. Listen, job is done. I feel like, look, we're not. I'm not gonna get over excited. We're not going to win the the, the Premier League. You understand? But we can definitely finish second or third this season. I've got 100% faith in our squad because. 
the performance, just the teamwork, the work rate. And you even saw like the, the team saw together, even after we score, you see Shaka, Jesus talking, we're all talking in a huddle as a group. Like that's the kind of thing that makes me feel like this team is special. So yeah, man, big up Arsenal on this victory. You get me? Come on, Arsenal.